Welcome back to Good Day Atlanta. Just before 9 10 now, and she defeated challenger after challenger on Fox's The Four, holding her seat all the way from episode one to the finale. Yeah. And everybody knows she finally got her me. And everybody knows she put it all on the grin. But everybody knows that he ain't making the bend. Why well, I say it once and now I gotta say it again. Say less, say less, say less. Say less, say less, say less. Say less, say less, say less. Say less, say less. She is fabulous. And letter rapper Sharia J is here to talk about her phenomenal run on the show and also competing while battling breast cancer. Sharia, it's mm -hmm. such a pleasure to have you here with such us today. Such a pleasure to be here. Yeah, congratulations. <laughs> Thank you so much. I mean, much. making it all the way to the end. That's Man, pretty incredible. What is a blessing for sure. Yeah, my yeah. gosh. Okay, so what we just played, we played a clip of your new single, Say Less, and we're going to talk about that coming up in just a little bit. But cool. uh, what was it like for you, you know, having started out in this competition? I remember I had a chance to interview all of the contestants from the beginning. Yes. And if it, we were judging from what happened the year before, <laughs> I didn't talk to them again because they were all gone. <laughs> right. But you, you made it. Yes. Um, man, it, I was just saying, like, what a dope journey you know what I mean um, I started there at the beginning and walking in with no real expectation just the concept where every time I stepped on that stage I would leave it all on the floor and give 150 mm percent -hmm. and week after week it just was working for me and you know and the creator too was walking me right through it and so I was just showing up to just do my best every time yeah you know what's so unique about you one of the many things is that you're your own person I mean look at even from down to your your costumes yes. when you're performing so how how much of this is is just really you? I mean, is this your style, or do you have people kind of, you know, helping you along the way? Is this Sharia? No, this is seeing? this is actually a really a blessing because that was me in collaboration with some really great people, uh -huh. like on the show. Um, like I was saying, when I used to walk into wardrobe, I loved the relationship we had. Um, Eric Archibald was like the head of wardrobe here, and he understood who I wanted to be or who mm -hmm. I am as an mm -hmm. artist. And so even with hair and makeup, Tanya Green was really good at that too and so when we would get in those rooms we would just vibe off each other and come up with some great stuff so it was a real collaboration yeah I mean you stand out Thank in the you. best way Thank in the you. very best way okay so take me back to that moment the mm -hmm. finale it's you and it's James Graham yeah you're standing there yes. you have no idea what's gonna happen what is going through your head in those final moments you know what to be honest in that moment I still had great feelings like I felt like what a ride we just we all had just accomplished so much you know what I mean and any way that it had turned out I was going to be okay with because I had told everybody like when I started the journey I had God and I trusted whatever he said or you know would be the right way and I wasn't going to start discrediting you know that journey mm -hmm. just because it hadn't turned out the way everybody thought it would you know because it still turned out I still feel like I walked away with a W regardless yeah. you know yeah that's something we were talking about during the break is that you you can't even pay for that exposure uh, no. that you got from being a part of the epic. show it was epic yeah. I can't you know just yeah. a blessing that's it's just priceless. I keep saying that yeah and priceless a sure. blessing is a good way to put it and speaking of that you were very open about your battle with stage two breast cancer yes. throughout the entire show and you also gave us an update during the finale on how you're doing now so, so can you let our viewers know what's going on? Yes. Yeah, so I said it was so funny because initially the great part was when I first got my chair, they didn't even know I was battling with that mm -hmm. uh, diagnosis. Mm -hmm. And so after getting, you know, more into it, I decided after thinking about it, you know, it was something I probably should share because I would be going through it literally during the course of the show. Right in the middle of it. And so, yeah. yes, the creator at the end of the show, I was able to announce that my uh, tumor had gone disappeared wow. um, and I found that out just my my treatment before that and um, when the doctor told me in the room I was ecstatic about it and so when Diddy asked me about it on the show I was also ecstatic to share mm. with the world because it, it had been such an intense journey so for happy for you Thank so you. so happy for you I mean what was it like though being in this intense spotlight dealing with something like that so personal like yeah. that I mean even the physical effects of it had Man. to be challenging what it was it was and I'm not even going to sugarcoat it for one second it was tough some of those days uh, our schedule was crazy so it was always seven days a week mm -hmm. working hard and some of those days I couldn't even really get out of you know it was tough to get out of bed but mm -hmm. you know after a while the support and love that I was getting from the fans and from the people around the world I started to realize that I was getting up not for myself but for them too and so yeah. that just gave me more strength to Gosh, you inspired a lot of people you know one thing I really like in the clip that we just showed I love when they, they go to Diddy and he is just <laughs> jamming along with you 
you. So, so what was it like to, to get to interact with that panel? I mean, it was a great panel what? on Amazing. Fox's The Four. Yeah. yeah. Iconic, really, because uh, Biggie is one of my favorite lyricists of all time. Uh -huh. And so for me to be able to get up there and perform those joints, especially Juicy, in front of Puff, yeah, and yeah. Um, that was just a lot of pressure for me, but yeah. just an iconic moment for me. Sure. And I love all three of the judges because they really gave some really sound advice that actually is very reminiscent or very similar to how the music business is. Uh -huh. And so I think that that was just beneficial for all the artists. Who yeah, to learn stage. from them. What? I mean, they've been there and they've done that. Right. Okay, so you're single. We played that off the very top. Say mm -hmm. less. Yes, say less. Pretty cool. Love um, the sound. Thank you. <laughs> Love that. Love that. So what's next for you? Well, where are we going to see you next? Yeah, right? I know. I got so many great things on the horizon. This is why I say even walking away, I still felt like I was just winning, you know. Mm -hmm. um, because I actually I do have a video that I'm about to drop for Say Less. Awesome. Um, Say Less has been doing really great. Um, and it's so funny because it's actually one of my real slags that I say normally in my conversation. So it really took off. Yeah. Um, I got some good stuff coming up for, uh, for Fashion Week and um, some really good film opportunities. And then I get to take a little break. I'm about to head to <laughs> <You've heard laughs> go it. to Hawaii for a little bit for like two weeks. So I'm excited about that. You have totally earned it. Again, I want you to you. know we are incredibly proud of you and Thank it is you. such a pleasure to get to get to visit with you today again Thank congratulations you, appreciate that yeah, Shereya J with us and our thanks to Fox Publicity for help coordinating today's interview Shereya J's song Say Less is available on Spotify hey. and for more on Shereya J and the four use the Fox 5 Atlanta app and look for the viewer information story. Always love it when these Atlanta artists do well. Yes. Yeah. Thanks again for coming in today. Thank you. Let's get you caught up on